Gary McNeil, I'm a PGDE primary student. Today we had a science micro teaching session with a group of children, primary six pupils, where we had 25 minutes in groups to deliver a session on body systems. We had loads of different resources that were to use. My group used VR, which was really cool, the kids really enjoyed that. We also used iPads, different types of apps. Um, we found it really important to try and bring as much technology into science as possible. One thing I really enjoyed about the session was having the opportunity to use different types of tech that wouldn't usually be available and it would be available in my placement school so it was good to get to use that, use the VR, see how the kids reacted to it as well. One thing I found challenging was the number of adults that were in the room because there was a lot of students. I'm used to class of 29 kids so that was a struggle. Um, but it was really enjoyable. It was good to work in a group to try and plan a lesson, see how uh, people do it differently. So for it was a good, good session. Um, Hands-on approach like for this task was so important because I think a lot of it we're getting taught theory and it's good to try and apply it um, in like a safe and secure environment where you've got your lectures around you and you've got that support system. It's so important, it's so important to try and get pupils engaged as much as possible in STEM. It's such a big area within Scottish education at the moment. I think children, like the use of technology is part of their everyday lives and might get them more engaged and learn about, learn about STEM subjects, learn about science and using new strategies to help their learning. I think the best bit about today was getting to use the new technology, was getting to use the VR, um, trying out different things on the iPads and seeing that the kids were actually engaging in lessons that we planned. had a very great opportunity because we invited the primary uh, students, P6, from Corpus Christi and our PGD primary students had the chance to teach in a micro-teaching um, style their own lessons about the body systems. The lessons were structured in a very spe specific way. We had four different rooms and in each room we had four different type of resources. The first room was more traditional teaching, the second room was based on tradi traditional teaching and augmented reality, the third room was based on virtual reality and the traditional teaching, and in the fourth room we had a focus on gender awareness and puberty. It was uh, for us a way to teach to our students that technology is nothing to fear, but technology will never substitute a good teaching coming from the teacher themselves. So teachers are the best resources that they have for their own classroom. All the other resources available are just to augment, to improve, to make it a better experience, but they are the focus of teaching and their passion is all they really have to, to transfer to their students. So my focus and my study is based on proving that virtual reality is a great tool that has to be uh, implemented, in my opinion, in schools, but also st teachers will have to realize that themselves as the best resources that they really have. So learn how to use all of this technology, but and blend it together with very effective um, pedagogy methodologies that are, have been already. It was a great experience. They all had the chance to overcome any fear they had. They are absolutely brilliant and they are all ready for their placement now that's taking place next week. They can't wait to actually be engaging their, their students and science as fun and this is what they actually learned today and they taught us about today. Hi, my name is Shine and I'm from Corpus Christi Primary. I am Sophia and I'm in this class and then I put it on the back. But it was like kind of like 
goggles and like uh, when you put them on you can like see the whole brain and like how it looks like yeah. um you got to like learn more about the brain and like you got to see everything to learn more about all the stuff we've been learning here and so when we come to university we can like learn more <laughs>